cannot be on your anti-equality calling committee. Sissy, you don't believe in equality, do you? I most certainly do. What's going on? Sissy believes in equality now. Well, then you don't believe the Bible, and you're not right with your maker. Jesus spoke to us. He said, no service to the gays. No cakes, no flowers, no photos, and nobody to perform the weddings. No gay marriage ever, ever, ever. Shh. And that is a look at a very sordid wedding. The sequel to writer and director Del Shore's hit play movie and TV series, Sorted Lives. Del is here with us this morning, along with Emerson Collins, actor and producer who stars in it. Thank you so much for being here, gentlemen. Thanks for having us. Yeah, so this looks hilarious, first of all. What inspired you to return to these characters, Del? Well, you know, it's been 17 years since mm -hmm. the, the, the first movie, and, and I guess about eight since the series. Yes. And the fans, they just kept saying, we want more, we want more. And I thought, how can I do this? And, you know, not completely relight the whole set because the actors have aged. <laughs> <You know? laughs> so I thought, because it's always, Story of Life's always been a period piece. So right. I thought, you know, with what's going on, and with gay marriage and everything, and mm -hmm. the Supreme Court decision had just come in, so I just wrote the script, and it was it was pretty easy to return to the characters. Yeah, and Emerson, how has it been for you to play this character? Well, this is really exciting. As the producer, it's fun to help make Dell's vision a reality, and he wrote this part of the bisexual serial killer for me. Uh, not quite typecasting. <laughs> um, is it true to life, is what you're yes, saying? Yes, yes, okay. it was very based on my personal experience. <gasps> it's, it's real hard to draw on your personal experience when you, you're, you're supposed to be a killer, but right. know, what do you do? A yeah. cockroach? <laughs> yeah. Well, so much has changed socially in the environment since the first time that you wrote this, right? It really has, I mean, and, and, and I took the, the character of Ty, the, which is you know loosely based on me and the character that Bonnie Bedelia plays Latrell, loosely based on my mom, and I, I really wanted to show uh, how the world has evolved yeah. when you put a face on gay. And I love Bonnie Bedelia's performance and her journey, and also Del Dickey, who plays Sissy, that you saw in the clip. Mm -hmm. it, it, it's a, it, because we, always, we, we, we sometimes obsess about the people who are hating us all the time, and they're in this movie too. But we, also, we forget to also acknowledge that a lot has changed in a positive way, and we celebrate that in the film as well. And there'll be a premiere in Palm Springs soon? Tell yes. us about that. Yes, next Friday. The original film sort of became a cult classic uh -huh. out of Palm Springs and the community there taking it nationwide. So we will be at the Camelot Theaters uh -huh. uh, next Friday with 20 of the 32 cast members in attendance. That's a good showing. Yes, yes. they are. Wow. They're all coming down. And so this is sold out, is that right? The yes, premiere? the world premiere is okay. sold out. We're doing a very sort of weekend of events. We're doing a big Q&A with the cast on Saturday night. And then after Palm Springs, we move to L.A. and Fort Lauderdale and Atlanta and Dallas in a limited theatrical release. And so can people still get tickets to the Q&A on Saturday? Yes, they, wanna... they can. Yes, At our and website. all weekend long. We're going to, I mean, Emerson and I will be introducing the film every single screening. We're going to go down there and we're going to milk this, you know? <laughs> yes. <laughs> and what other projects do you have coming up? Anything else? I'm working on a new TV show and I have a new uh, a play that I've been working on called This Side of Crazy, which is, it's not my story, but, uh, you know, I think we all... Some of us in, in, in this business, we, we reside on one side or the other. Mm -hmm. So got a lot of projects. And of course, just really working this film right now. And, and we, we, it took us two, two years to make this film. So, you know, raising the money for a little indie like this. And yeah. we got lucky with Whoopi doing a cameo in it. And so many of the wonderful actors returning. So we really want to... And it's incredibly relevant to what's happening in our culture right now. You know, the marriage equality decision has passed, but we're still seeing uh, opposition to equal rights ordinance and what's happening particularly with the trans community. So this idea of the pushback of, quote, religious freedom, mm -hmm. you know, is really important beyond the marriage equality decision. So we're excited to travel with the film and keep engaging in that discussion. Very interesting. Well, thank you so much. And people can see the film, then it'll be at independent theaters. In independent film, mm -hmm. a, a very sorted wedding.com will have, okay. every, and you can find us on Facebook. We are on that social media. Awesome. So. Well, thank you guys so much. It looks wonderful. Thank, thank you. you so Thanks much. Thanks for coming in. And of course, to find out more about a very sorted wedding, including how to get tickets to the second night screening in Palm Springs, just go to our website, kcal9.com, and click on Scene on TV. We'll be right back.